So, what is it that you want to do by this time next year? This time next year, I want to have a full set of teeth. <laughs> why is that? Um, basically, because my teeth have had it. And why have your teeth had it? Um, I grew up in America. Um, very, very expensive dental over there. I didn't really have any regular dental treatments. Um, every time I had a problem, I just had a tooth pulled out. Well, and rather um, than fix it, they just pulled it out? Just pulled it out because we couldn't afford to fix it. Oh, oh no! Just so expensive. So, um, then I moved back to England. I've had 15 teeth pulled out. Um, where? Where? Because I can see all the ones at the front. They're all at the back. I only have two back teeth. I only have front teeth now. Oh, mm. my goodness. Is yeah. that hard to look at? That's really hard. Yeah. Quite gross. So. But those, all those ones at the bottom at the back are completely missing. So They're how gone. do you eat? I've been chewing on my front teeth for a long time and they've become very, very loose um, and very, very thin. What have been the hard things about your teeth? I mean, I noticed when you walked out of the door, you didn't smile. No, I'm, I don't. I, I've got, I do smirk. Yeah. I do this when I'm talking, very conscious about my mouth. Um, especially talking to at business with clients and stuff. I think they I'm a wedding caterer. Oh. Mm, you know, and I want to be friendly with people and I think they're looking at my mouth. They're looking at my teeth. They're thinking, yeah. oh, you know, and all my photographs as well from from ever. They're all with my mouth closed. What are you going to have to do with your teeth? I wrote to a, a Harley Street dentist and they have decided that they will help me as a case study. Um, they're the only dentist in Britain, I believe, that can do this for me. Yeah. What's it going to mean to you to get this done? It will be... Um... <laughs> it will be... Thank you. The completion of a journey has mm. taken... I don't know, 35 years to get to. Mm. <laughs> I'll be able to look back at photos. But I look nice and I'm smiling like everyone else. And I just might feel pretty again, you know? Yes. Thank you. Rebecca, by this time next year, you will have a full set of teeth. Thank you. Good luck. Thank you. <laughs> Has Rebecca managed to transform her smile? Let's see. Look fabulous. <laughs> um, what look how beautiful your smile is. Thank you. What's that like? Um, well, my husband says to me, Stop smiling, you're freaking everyone out. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, Well, if you hadn't smiled for as long as I would, you want to get it all in, you know. Got a lot of making up to do. Are you quite emotional now? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Has it been a tough journey? Um, the um, day of surgery was was tough. We've got actually um, some footage of that day of the surgery. Oh. <laughs> Let's have a look. OK. We are the night before the surgery. I'm tucked up, ready to go to bed. Tomorrow, my horrible, disgusting teeth will all be gone. And the first part of my lovely new smile should begin, I hope. Wish me luck. We'll see you tomorrow. I feel like I've been waiting for this day forever to arrive. Today will definitely transform my life and it will give me my self-confidence back.
The problem with Rebecca's teeth is that she's lost her back teeth and she's lost bone around her front teeth. So her front teeth are splaying outwards and they're loose. Um, essentially, these front teeth are hopeless. There's just not enough bone to hold them in place. So what we're doing today is we're going to get Rebecca her new teeth on four implants in each arch. And to do that, we have to remove all the teeth. We have to get the bone nice and level. We have to get rid of any infections. Once we've done that, we'll be placing the implants. By the end of today, she'll be a different person. It's a life-changing procedure. In just a few moments, Rebecca will be coming over to see me, and it's my job to take her old smile and convert it to her new smile. And we will actually screw the teeth into her implants, which are now firmly rooted in her mouth. This is the moment that she will be able to get up, have a look in the mirror, and really see her beautiful smile emerge. No matter how many times I do this, and I really do it a lot of times, it never fails to be the most exciting moment when the patient gets up and looks in the mirror and sees her beautiful new smile. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. Take a look. Oh my God. Oh my God. It doesn't even look like me. This most probably be one of the best days of my life. It really has. It's been just something that I never thought would happen. And I never thought I'd get it. And it's, it's there, they're there. And it's just incredible. And I'm so grateful. I just don't think you'll know how grateful I am. So now, when someone wants to take a photo, you're at the front of the line. Yeah, yeah. With a big smile, yeah, <laughs> exactly. Yeah, definitely. How would you sum up what it's done for you? I just think it's, it's just given me a completely new outlook on life and I feel, oh, why not? I feel 20 years younger, you know. Um, I feel younger, I, I wear lipstick, you know. Um, I never Did you not wear never, lipstick? I never wore lipstick. I don't want anyone looking at Don't my mouth, attract so. attention. Mm. So it's, it's completely changed me, it's brilliant. We've got a little um, film of how your life's changed at work. Okay. <laughs> my new teeth have changed my work experience so much. We've got some tweaks and some classics and we've got some new dishes. I am tasting flavours and foods that I've never tasted before because I couldn't chew. Mmm. Yeah. It's brilliant. Rebecca is a changed woman. It's nice to see she's not afraid to have different things and the kitchen's changed a lot more on the menu. Really exciting to see the food that she's producing. It's given her a boost. Ever since she's had her teeth done, she's now become a selfie queen. Yay! <laughs> so it's really nice to see that change in her and to see her blossom, really. <laughs> she would never want to be in a picture, but now she's literally at the forefront. She's beautiful. I love the camera now. It's not my enemy. <laughs> Pictures, don't you? Well, if you had these teeth, you'd smile all the time too. Is there a part of you, having seen the massive impact that it's had on the way you feel about yourself, that wishes you'd done it sooner? Oh, God. If I'd done it 20, 20 years ago, mm. you know, my life, I don't know. I don't know. I love my life, you know. Um, I've got great friends, great family. Um, I love my job. Now I can eat my job because I can try my food. And what about your husband? What does he think? Um, he thinks I'm going to run off with a young Italian, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Let him think that for yeah, a bit. That's yeah, good. It's good, it's good. Yeah, it's good. It's got to keep him on his toes. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, listen, Rebecca, it's just so lovely to see you like this. Oh, thank you. And well done you. It's a pretty big step that you took, yeah. but you did it. Thank you. Absolutely brilliant. Ladies and gentlemen, Rebecca. Thank you.